Hey, what's up? Robert here coming at you with another Photoshop tutorial, this time showing you how to enhance your blurry images. So, let's say you went to an aquarium and it, it's low light, you're not allowed to use flash. You're trying to take pictures of these fishes and they're just moving around like, hey, you can't catch me. And you end up taking a slightly blurry picture, not as you were hoping for, especially if you got such a priceless shot of this fish looking at you. So, you know, you want to enhance this picture. And we can do that in Photoshop using a really simple method. Here's what we're going to end up with. You can see the fish is a lot sharper and we still have our priceless face over here. Alright, so let's get started. The first thing I'm going to do is open up my image of Nemo. I was able to catch Nemo while he was looking for that other dumb fish. So here is kind of blurry. Very quick thing we can do is duplicate this background layer, click and drag it down to the new layer icon. Then we're going to go to filter, other, high pass. And this is going to add a high pass filter. Now, what you want to do is adjust the radius accordingly to how you want it to, to you know, end up at the end. You can see here, this is way too much. So I'm going to bring the radius down just barely to where I see the lines. And I see the areas that I want to enhance, all the details I want to see. So around 3.1 pixels is going to work for this image. And you can tell that's pretty much how you want to end up with your high pass filter. We're just going to simply change the blend mode from normal to overlay. And if you look at our before and after, you can see it kind of sharpened up the front area there. And of course, this isn't a miracle tool. It's not going to turn your extremely blurry photos clear again. And there's not really any ways that I know of to enhance those extremely blurry photos. But I don't know, you never know, maybe a future version of Photoshop is going to come out with some kind of content aware sharpen. That'd be kind of neat. Uh, you know, takes your mushy, blurry photos and just transforms them into a good looking sharp picture. Alright, well I tried this with my trusty bear right before I got attacked and it came out a little blurry. I've, I've duplicated the layer, added a filter high pass and you could tell it kind of fixes it but it doesn't fix it as much as I'd like it to it's a little bit too overexposed on this side of the face it just didn't turn out how I wanted it but uh, you know it's the only picture I took of this bear on my wilderness trip don't look at the ceiling you know it's the only picture I took of this bear and uh, unfortunately I'm not going to really be able to enhance it anymore I also took a picture of this this guy here um, he was climbing on on this what is that, a wolf? Wolf's rock. And the wolf was like, don't be climbing my rock. And look at look at that stare. That's, look at that. Yeah. So, you know, if I were that guy, I'd, I'd back up. I'd go back down. Uh, especially with that thing. I don't like the look of that. Or that. You know, two against one. Oh, there's another one. Three. Hiding in the bushes. Oh, four. You just got to This is like, this all of a sudden turned into, where's Waldo? And then last but not least, I uh, was able to catch this picture of a deer and you know I think the flash on the camera kind of took him off guard now look at this picture I can just imagine myself driving down the road you know seeing this this face right here I want to know what to do it's like is it playing games with me or what all right so there there's that why are you taking a picture of me anyway there's that enhancing your blurry photos in Photoshop you can follow me on Twitter at Robs Productions visit the site robertsproductions.net if you have any questions comment below or shoot me an email at the link in the description you can also like me on Facebook as well as subscribe to this channel for more weekly tutorials just like this one hope this helped thanks for watching see you next time